Two people were in court to face sex trafficking charges. They were arrested after a chance traffic stop. NBC 10's Tony Gugliotta is outside the courthouse in Providence this noon hour with that story. Tony? Well, Frank, yeah, the arraignment of the two alleged kidnappers just ended here inside Providence District Court. Now their families are fighting back. 28-year-old Michael Gomes and his girlfriend, 29-year-old Niesha Bissell, both arraigned on charges of kidnapping and sex trafficking after a 24-year-old female from East Providence tipped off with her cell phone, tipped police off, rather, with her cell phone during a traffic stop. State police say they pulled over Bissell's car on Potter's Avenue in Providence just after midnight Wednesday for not having a front license plate. And as police approached that vehicle, the alleged victim typed the words, get me out of the car on her phone while she was sitting in the back seat and showed police that's when they made arrest. Now, the families of the alleged suspects defended them outside of court today. Check her records because that story's bogus. That story is bogus. I don't even want to go into detail, but that story's bogus. I think something got twisted along somewhere along the way. Somebody got upset with somebody and maybe that's what it, it came down to. But truthfully, it shouldn't even went like that. You know what I mean? So they both don't live lives like that, the male or, or my daughter. That's Kim Gomes, the male suspect's mother, and Barry Sullivan, the female suspect's father. Now, coming out of NBC 10 News at 5 o'clock, much more on this story, including the relationship between the alleged victim in this case and those two defendants. We'll see you then. Live in Providence, Tony Gugliotta, NBC 10 News.